Rin, din, 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 din. Chapter 5, Luke. While the, while the crowd is pressing in on Jesus and listening to the word of the Lord, word of God, he was standing there by the lake of Jesenaret. He saw two boats alongside of the lake, and the fishermen had disembarked and were washing their nets. Getting on one of these boats, the one belonged to Simon, he asked them to put out a short distance from the shore. He sat down and taught the crowds from the boat. After he had, te after he had finished speaking, he said to Simon, Put into deep water and lower your nets for a catch. Simon said in reply, Master, we have worked hard and all night and have caught nothing, but at your command I will lower the nets. And when he had done this, they caught a great number of fish that their, and their nets were tearing. They signaled to their partners on the other boats to come help them. They came and filled both boats so that they were in danger of sinking. When, when Simon Peter saw this, he fell on his knees of Jesus and said, Depart from me, Lord, I am a sinful man. For the astonishment of the catch, for astonishment at the catch of fish, he had they had made seized him, and all those around him. And likewise, James and John, the son of Zebedee, who were partners of Simon, Jesus said to Simon, "Do not be afraid. From now on, you'll be catching, you'll be catching men." They were brought on. They brought their boats to the shore and left everything and followed him. Now that there was a man full of leprosy, now there was a man full of leprosy, and one of the towns. There, where he was, and where he was saw Jesus, he fell prostrate, he placed him, and said, Lord, if you wish, you can make me clean. Jesus stretched out his hand, touched him, and said, I would do it, be made clean. And the leprosy left him immediately. Then he ordered him not to tell anyone, but go, walk, show yourselves to the priest, and offer your cleansing what Moses prescribed. What That will be proof for them. The report about him spread all the more, the, cry, the great crowds assembled to listen to him and to be cured of their ailments, but he would withdraw but he would withdraw to desert places to pray. Once again, what the hell is this? Oh, another COVID outbreak. When he, when he would withdraw to desert places to pray, one day as Jesus was teaching, uh, Pharisees and teachers of the law were sitting there, who had come from every village to Galilee and Judea, Jerusalem, to listen to the power of the Lord, as to, to listen to the, and the power of the Lord was with him for healing. And some men brought on the stretcher of the man who was paralyzed. They were trying to bring him and set him in his, in his presence. But not finding a way to bring him in because of the crowd, they went up to the roof and lowered him on the stretcher through the tiles. On to the middle on the, in the front of Jesus. When he saw their faith, he said, As for you, your sins are forgiven. Your sins are forgiven. And the, then the scribes and Pharisees began to ask themselves, Who is this who speaks blasphemies? Who by God alone can forgive sins? Jesus knew their thoughts and said to them in reply, What are you thinking in your hearts? Which is easier to say, Your sins are forgiven, or say, Rise and walk. But that you may know that the Son of Man has authority on earth to forgive him sins, to forgive sins. He said to the man who was paralyzed, I say to you, rise, pick up your stretcher, and go home. He stood up immediately before them, picked up, picked up what he had been lying on, and went home to glorify God. Then the astonishment seized them all, and they all glorified God, and struck with all. They said, we have, we have seen... We have been seeing incredible. We have seen incredible things today. After this, he went out and saw a tax collector called Levi sitting at a customs house. He said to him, "Follow me." Leaving everything behind, he got up and followed him. And Levi gave a great, great banquet for him in his house, and a large crowd of tax collectors and others were at a table with them. Then the Pharisees and their scribes complained to his disciples, saying, "Why do you eat and drink with tax collectors and sinners?" Jesus said to him in reply. Those who are healthy do not need a physician, for the sick do. I have not come to I have not come to call the righteous but repentance to repentance but sinners. Then they said to him then they said to him, Disciples of John fast often and they often and often offer prayers, and the disciples of Pharisees do the same, but yours eat, eat and drink. Uh, Jesus said to them, Can you make the wedding guests fast while the bridegroom is with them? But the days would come when the bridegroom was taken from them, and they will fast in those days. And he also he also told them in a parable, no one tears a piece from a new cloak to match an old one, unless he will tear the new and and the piece from it will not match the old old cloak. 
And he also told them in a parable, No one tears a piece from a new cloak to patch an old one, otherwise he will tear the new and, and the piece from it and not match the old cloak. Otherwise no one pours new wine from into old wine skins. Otherwise the new wine will burst the skins and be spilled and it will, and it will be spilled. The skins will be ruined. Rather new new wine must be poured into fresh wine skins. And no one who had been no one who has been drinking old wine desires new, for he says the old is too good. Okay, that's uh, chapter five, I believe. Chapter six now. Dun bum bum bing 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 boom. Thank you for watching our show. Have yourselves a good night.